Jenna still remembers how scary it was to be 16 weeks pregnant with her son Gabriel and unsure of his fate. And they diagnosed him at that point with an omphalocele, where his bowel was on the outside of his body. A nurse at Bethesda North, she found herself playing the role of patient as she was transferred to Good Samaritan Hospital. Always checking his fluid level and biophysical profile, making sure he was growing, all that stuff. Gabe was born early with multiple complications. So he had an enlarged tongue, enlarged organs, low blood sugar, and a lot of other things. So he's he's a tough cookie. He's been through a lot. So Jenna can appreciate the new multi-million dollar changes unveiled today at Good Sam. The changes to the newly named Tri-Health Advanced Obstetrical Care Unit include modern state-of-the-art technology, better fetal monitoring systems, and private rooms for each patient. It is designed specifically for expecting mothers with severe complications. We've systematically modernized and updated and upgraded uh, pretty much all of our patient care areas. I bring the spirit of peace. The staff met today to bless the renovated wing, which also includes an area for the families to bond. Just an area where they can enjoy a movie together or can play a board game or can have a quick meal together. Expecting mothers who find themselves in long-term care might see Jenna around. Her complications with Gabriel inspired a career change. I love it. I've been here for almost a year. Actually, October 2nd, it'll be a year that I've been here. As Jenna has shifted from maternity at Bethesda to the long-term care unit at Good Samaritan, she's found strength and empathy. I love making that connection with people and you know letting them know that you know, I was here and I, I know how you're feeling and there's life after being in here. At Good Samaritan Hospital, Vanessa Richardson, WLWT News 5.